Hello, viewers. This is DX Williams, and we are on part 18 of Dishonored, and we are trying to sneak into Sokolov's house. I thought we were going to get him last episode, but I guess I'll have to get him this episode. That's what I'm planning on, at least. I don't even know if there's a way around all this. Let's see. Oh, yes. There we go. Oh crap, didn't mean to do that. Ruins nearby. And up. Okay. Come on, guys. Feeling a little sick today, sorry. Come on. Oh my. I made it to Silkloth's house. I only have. shoot. Shoot. Just be quiet. I have to abduct Sokolov. Alive. That's Sokolov? Is he in there alone? He's in there alone, guys. I just need to find a way inside. Now turn my hopes is to defy, which in conjunction with a high. To get him unconscious. Most vividly in a dream last night, has great potential, according to the latest hey. celestial light. What? How did you get past all the guards? Your tattoo is quite unusual. It is reminiscent of markings I've studied on cave walls far from the city. Who sent you, Piero? That's a terrible thing. There's no need to be his lap hound. You and I can come to. One that I'm sure will please you more than anything Piero dreamed up. Who are you? What is it you want? Money? Elixir against the plague? I don't know how you got past all the defenses, but I think I can assume if you wanted me dead, well, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Everything within my power to give you is yours. If you'll just let me go. I can see you are an intelligent man. So you understand there will be repercussions. Shut up. I'll take that. How many rings do I have now? Oh, so close. Two more runes. And I'll have what I want. This isn't good. Can jump around with him on my back. Okay, good. Oh, oh, oh! I'm sorry. Sorry. Huh. Take that. Oh, for God's sake! Stop falling out of my. Thank you, whoever you are. He kept me in a cage, like an animal. You're right, The pain is horrible right now. So I'll just hide in a corner and leave when I'm feeling better. All right. Do you need an elixir? Do you need, do you need an elixir? You'd be okay? I just, I'm a good guy, to be honest. I am. How am I going to get out of here? Carry it to Samuel Boatman. Under the bridge near Sokolov's home. Okay. 
just need to find a way to get there safely and quietly. Oh my. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. Oh my! To pass me by. All the others down with the sickness. Position himself. You made a neat job of it. Drop him here and we'll be off. All right, let's go. Let's go. Yes, I got it. I'm overall, can I didn't even cause that much chaos. Let's be honest. I didn't get much coins either. Dang, I should really be looking for coins. Oh boy, I've not been this far in this game. I'm kind of nervous, guys. Hold my hand. They set up a cell for Sokolov in the old kennel. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock, him waking up in the straw and old dog poop. <laughs> what I hear, he's woken up worse places. Guess we all have at that. <laughs> I'm not an alcoholic, though. Why would I wake up in bad places? I'm only doing crack. No, I'm just kidding. Well done, Corporal. Well done. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done it better. Sokolov's well, knowledge duh. will enable us to strike at the Lord Regent directly. And ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, we won't have to hide in shadows. The royal physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machine. He could have made us a great nation. Now he pays the price for siding with a tyrant. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is a good time. Get some rest. Mission clues object. Okay, where's Emily? I don't want any of these powers. I want this. Um, J. Let's see. Get some rest. So close. It's kind of conscious. Hey, bone charms. Let's go get this. Attention, citizens. This evening, the street that takes you to Pendleton Manor will be closed. For a private ceremony following the tragic loss of two of our city's best and brightest, the Lords Custis and Morgan Pendleton. The crap. All holdings and parliamentary votes now fall to Lord Trevor Pendleton, who asks for respect during this time of mourning. Why can't I open it? I need a key? Are you kidding me? Is there a window? No. Nope. Whatever, I don't need it. I would like to find Emily. And say goodnight. Where the crap is she? Come on, come on. Let's find her. Display your pride in Dunwall by respecting the property and rights of others in these trying times. Preserve it. Ooh. Whoa, 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 this is the song. 
What will we do with the drunken whaler? What will we do with the drunken whaler? What will we do with the drunken whaler early in the morning? Feed him to the hungry rats for how does that go? Feed him to the hungry rats for dinner. Feed him to the hungry rats for dinner. Feed him to the hungry rats for dinner early in the morning. Hey, hey, and up she rises. Hey, hey, and up she rises. Hey, hey, and up she rises early in the morning. Slice his throat with a rusty cleaver. Slice his throat with a rusty cleaver. Slice his throat with a rusty cleaver early in the morning. Stuff him in a sack and throw him. Wait, stuff him in a sack and throw him over. Stuff him in a sack and throw him over. Stuff him in a sack and throw him over early in the morning. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises. Way, hey, and up she rises early in the morning. The morning. That's a that's a beautiful song. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, you trying to hide? No. Hemlock, you little goofy. Hemlock. Oh. Lord Pendleton has departed for the evening to attend to matters at the manor. It concerns the departure of his brother. Hmm. I like how many books they have. I, I should really like try to read them actually. But um, I might go through my videos and read them later. I'd like to find Attention Dunwall citizens. You are required to boil any water. Oh. Brave Brahosa. Public fountains or the river. Anyone who has consumed untreated water must be I never really explored. Reported to the watch. So many books. Dang. Whoa. Thank you. Is that it, guys? Is that all you have for me? You guys sleeping together? Is that how? Is that how it is? Is that how you are, guys? That's just. That's. I accept that. We're getting closer to reaching our goals, but our position is becoming more dangerous. You don't house and feed a half dozen people without leaving telltale traces. Riverboats pass day and night, and the looters are going to start gathering once they're sure the plague has burned the place out. I conclude, <laughs> if our enemies are not dead by the month of wind, we will be. Sadness. Lady Emily Caldwell she was abducted some six months past. Death of her mother just a half a year ago, better than most heroes on earth. Anyone with Once information on leading to the location or return of the daughter of our oh, hey, man. late command is required to speak to the city walk. Lord Pendleton, Edwards, Chapter 41, in which I bed two of the Boyle women and only missed the third by virtue of some inclement weather. It was the month of rain. Sorry, guys. Counter the gloom, the boil ladies hosted three nights of merry rites. It's already up here. I can't remember. La di da, di da, di da, la di da, di da, la di da. This is not, but I want to. Where is Emily? Is there a map of some sort? Where's her room? Where? Wow. Could she be up there? Ouch! Shit! I hurt, man. Yeah. I swear. I'll find her. Ah, oh, she must be in here. The tower, she says. You must be as quiet as you can. It took forever for Emily to fall asleep. 
poor dear. It's okay, Emily, I'm here. She seems happier when you're here. Though I know you have important things to do. Out there, in the city. Doesn't mean I don't... I can't care for Emily. Remember, guys, if you want to read these books, like, you can pause it. Like, I'll keep, have a few, like, a second or two. And then I'll, like, scroll down, have a second or two. You can pause it. There's hardly a need to work on table etiquette. She knows it all, even if she chooses not to employ it. She'd rather hold her spoon by the wrong end and pretend it's a sword. Then suddenly she changes and she's all manners, asking for a tea party. I tried to oblige her, but I have little to work with. No proper plates instead of a cloth napkin. I've only the bar rack. Ale mugs instead of teacups. I've asked for things befitting her, but they have their minds on other things. For now, Emily and I decided to make a pretend dinner using paper and little things she's found here and there. On the floor, I suppose. Not right for a princess, but it'll have to do. Should I wake her up? No, I'm gonna let her sleep. I shall be back. Ooh, thank you. I shall be back, my 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 queen, my empress. Oh, I feel bad. Like honestly, viewers, look at her. It's not right. She still has bad dreams, though it's understandable given all she's been through. Sometimes she calls out your name. Sometimes she cries for her mother. Don't worry. Nothing ever bad will happen to you. I feel very protective of her now. Shit. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna actually go to bed here. Okay, so now I know. Just from my room, just out there and there. I'm gonna close the door. Sleep well, Emily. Alright. Let's go to bed. Time to rest. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. Corbo. Whoa, what? You were making funny faces while you were sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. Definitely. I'll always protect you. Callista will come get me when she's done with her bath. Thanks, Corvo. It makes me feel better. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time. I'm going to save real quick. Thanks, guys. Oh, Lady Boyle's party. I'm excited for that. All right, guys. Thank you. See you next time.